I ain't folding under pressure, I ain't switching for no hoe. I ain't talking to no cop and I ain't telling on my bros. Ain't no killer, but don't push me fingers itching on that pole. Niggas. What's good? It's a bitch, your boy K Flex, and back here with the schedule reaction. Now that I don't have the schedule on the screen right now, but um, I'm about to put it up. I just wanted to see it at the same time y'all seeing it. Okay, I told y'all I was going to do this, and I wanted it to be a legit, authentic reaction. So I haven't seen the schedule at all yet, but what I'm hoping, I, I really don't give a f honestly, but, but, um, you no, know, a lot of people say, oh, Miami Dolphins only made the playoffs because uh, two years ago because of easy schedule. I just want to address that real quick. First of all, we don't control who the f we play. Second of all, we got to play the Patriots two times every single year of our existence. Okay, Bruh. not of our existence. But, like, every year that we are in the league, we got to play the Patriots twice. Okay, it's no easy schedule when you got to play those ass motherfuckers twice a year. Your team might have to play them one time every four years, one time every two years, something like that. You never get getting off the hook. We got to play them every single fucking season. We had to play Tom Brady, okay? So stop saying Dolphins got an easy schedule. We don't never got an easy schedule. Niggas, we got Ravens fans talking about Dolphins had an easy schedule. We got the Browns in your division. Anyway, I don't care about this schedule, honestly. I only hope, I'm trying to go to the Cincinnati game, so I only hope that the Cincinnati game is early in the season, so I don't be out there in the freezing cold, even though it's going to be cold regardless. Uh, but that's it. I, I really don't care, so let's get into it. All right, this is the first time me seeing it. Let me analyze it real quick. So first thing I noticed on, on when I seen this, and I know my face is blocking some of the games. Hold up, we had no prime time games except for one. Okay, and to be honest with you, with the way that the Dolphins performed in prime time, I, I want to get mad. But the way that these niggas performed in prime time last season, um, you cannot argue with this. Okay, so we had no prime time games except for one, which is Houston Texans on Thursday night football. That game is prime time, but even even there. It, it's Thursday Night Football. I'm not even sure if I got NFL Network. I don't know if I'm watching that. I, I, I'm going to figure out a way to watch it. I, I'll figure out a way to watch every game. But uh, it's Thursday Night Football. That shit don't even count. But looking at the schedule, guys, Tennessee is a dub. Jets is a dub. We starting off this 4-0 no off game because we're going to beat Oakland. And honestly, I, I'm not even going to do this because I'm going to say we're going to beat everybody. So it. I'm not going to do it. Listen, I don't know, but I'm 100% going to Cincinnati. It's week five. I'm gonna go to that game uh, for sure. As soon as the tickets go on sale, I'm gonna try to try to get one. I don't know when it's the best time to get a ticket, uh, when it's gonna be more expensive, more cheap, but try to get the cheapest motherfucker. I'm just trying to be in the building, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, <clears throat> depending on how the season go, and I might even go to the Indianapolis game because that's only about two hours away from me. But looking at the schedule in itself, guys, this shit don't look, I mean, all right, look, let me be honest with y'all. Tennessee is trash. Okay, they're not trash. They're not good. I mean, we beat them. Did we beat them last year? We beat them. I think we beat them two years in a row. We can beat Tennessee, all right? Jets are fucking ass. Okay, I'm sorry, Jets fans. Go ahead, dislike. You do it all the time, anyway. Y'all ass. Uh, Oakland, uh, Oakland might be pretty good this year. They did beat us last year. New England, obviously, we got plays motherfuckers every single year. Cincinnati, I think we can beat. Chicago, we gonna beat. Detroit, we gonna beat. Houston, we gonna beat. New York Jets, we gonna beat their ass again. Green Bay, uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I, was, I ain't gonna say we gonna lose no game. I'm gonna let y'all know that right now. Uh, but I'm just gonna say I don't know about that. Um, Indianapolis, we should be able to beat. Buffalo, we should be able to beat. New England, we should be able to beat. Minnesota, yeah. Jacksonville, yeah. Buffalo, uh, we should be able to beat. So honestly, man, I don't even care. I got us going 12 and 4 this year. I don't. Go, I don't. I got us going 16. No, really. I I don't care about. I mean, this shit really doesn't matter at, at the end of the day. I'm just glad that we don't have to pay the Patriots like. Week 16, week 17, or something like that, when our playoff is like on the line, and then we gotta run into these motherfuckers. Let me see if it's at Fox Bro at the end of the year. All right, yeah, so I'm just happy we get we, that, cause, cause let's be honest, guys. New England at Fox Bro, guys, and I know New England fell off, but you know, guys, where they cheat over at Fox Bro. Right? So with that being said, I'm happy that that game gets over week four. Okay, I, I don't even want to see that L on the schedule past week four because it, let's be honest, they, the niggas cheat. All right, we could beat them, but it's gonna take everything in our hearts. Okay. But with the new roster, I think Tennessee and New York Jets are gonna be two good teams for the new for the new roster to get accustomed to. You know what I'm saying? They're not the best teams in the league. Not, we have to go up against a fucking crazy Minnesota team or something like that. So I think you know Minnesota's gonna be tough too. We, that oh my god, we're gonna have to win games early because that last New England Minnesota Jacksonville stretch, 
it's gonna be tough. We just gonna have to win games early, to be honest with you. Cause at the beginning, it's not that hard. Cincinnati, Chicago, Detroit, Houston. I don't. I mean, Houston's pretty good with Deshaun Watson, but I mean, come on, we could be a second year quarterback. We could do it. So I'm just saying, like, I think we could be anybody just because I'm a fan. But realistically speaking. That last four, three games, New England, Minnesota, and Jacksonville, that stretch right there, bro, we do not have to be in this position. We don't want to be in a position where we have to win every single one of them games to get in the playoffs because we liable to get – we liable to lose one of them, honestly. But anyways, guys, let, get in the conversation. Let me know what you guys think about the schedule. Like I said, I've been knew what our opponents was going to be, so I really never gave a – I'm just ready. I'm just ready for the season to start. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, you bring them on to Miami Dolphins, we're gonna knock them over. That's at the end of the day. That's how it's gotta be. I don't give a we had to pay the Patriots back to back weeks. You, you gotta you gotta find a way to get it done. But let me know what you guys think about it. Let me know what you guys think is gonna be W's or L's. I honestly think, you know, I'm not gonna say we ever gonna lose, so I'm not the guy to ask that question. But let me know what you guys want to think are going to be W's, L's. What's going to be the key stretch of the season? I think the, uh, the, the that December stretch is going to be very, very tough. So I think we're going to have to win a lot early in October and November. And uh, in November, we play the Jets in Indianapolis. We're going to have to win those two games. Uh, Green Bay, obviously, they have Aaron Rodgers. But if we can score on that, we'll be straight. So I think the key is to win early so we don't have to end up beating New England, Minnesota, and Jacksonville in consecutive weeks. I, I, Because <laughs> that's going to be tough. Anyways, get in the conversation. Let me know what you guys think. It's your boy K Flex, and I'm out. I know I want it for the crystal many times, but I know this moment will come. Now it's my time. I got to make up for all them nights that my mama cried. I'm going in. I'm putting.